Uh, oh, why'd my genre? Why does my genre always go away? Adventure? We did adventure, right? Yeah. Uh, the hunt for hmm, Harry Paws, hmm, the Golden Wolf, Wolf Time. No, uh, so many names and they're all mediocre. Okay, it took me a very long time, but we're going to go with Wolf Basement. In which you're a werewolf that has to clean his basement. It's a very, very awesome game. Wolf Basement. Come on, Wolf Basement. I know you can do it. Okay, my adventure game. No dialogues. AI, probably. Level design a little up. This is going to be a bomb. After Fat Cigar Man, things are just going to be horrible. Yeah! Get rid of those bugs, my friend. Get rid of those... Oh, wow, that was quick. Ta-da! New research, better dialogues. Let's do... I guess I click on each of us now. Or wait. Do I not have that option anymore? Where I can do that thing? Generate. Oh, he does it. Get to it, Dennis. First reviews for our new newly released game, Wolf Basement, came in. Oh, no. Oh, after Fat Sakar, man. Their focus on story quests served this well. Uninspiring. Fun at stages, like the last one. Son of a bitch. Vena has announced they will release a new gaming console in two months. The Vena Oasis comes with 16-bit gra graphics, graphics, and sound, which promises a new kind of gaming experience. Vena said at the announcement, The Oasis is a new start. It will be the genesis of a new generation. Haha, <laughs> see what they did. Gaming consoles, and we will believe it will do very well in the market. Some of the games already announced for the console suggest it will appeal to more mature audiences. I gotta do... Post-release analysis of Wolf Basement is Wolf and Adventure. <laughs> Werewolf and Adventure is okay. Gameplay seems to be not very important. Well, hot damn. Shit. I'm doing 3D graphics already. What am I doing? Oh. I should have done this. Come on, why can't you do that? Medium games? What does that even mean? I want to be all right. I think I think I'm gonna focus on like I don't know what I want to focus on. Oh my god, these are the worst freaking things. Alright. Movies? Jesus Christ. Today, the new game platform Venna Oasis by Venna has been released. Yay! Business. Target audience. There we go, you little babies. Wolf Basement now off the market. It sold 13,000, generating 91,000 in sales. All right. 
Alright, I guess we'll make a new game after you're done. I don't know why I can't do that sometimes. Is it cause is it cause I'm a genius? Oh god, I can move. Oh god. That's not good. You done? There you go. Better dialogues. Alright, we're gonna do one more game. I lied. Let's do Ah Space. Ah, what was space shite? Simulation, probably. Um, uh, mm. oh, last time was our spider ship, wasn't it? It was space, ah, uh, sp space action? Was it action? I'm guessing it was. Actually, sorry, let me, let's see. Game history. Tiger Marines, that's what it was. Space Adventure. Aliens Action. Space Adventure. Alright, we'll do Space Adventure. Oh, shite. Uh, Christ. I guess we'll do the Venna. Because it makes more sense. Um, okay, Combo. Go suck a dick. Space Action. Oh, space adventure is okay. Space action. I'm gonna go space action then. Uh, stars of Coranthian. No, that's boring. Um, angel astronauts. Ah, I spelled astronauts wrong. No. Nope, um, moon janitor. No, that's like we already played that game. M moon. Moon school. Yeah! Exclamation point. Welcome to moon school. Just when you thought school was over, you're going to moon school. Get ready for Moon School, the newest game from Tummy Sausage. Just when you thought things were getting bad, well, they're about to get ba 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 better. Moon School, it's freaking awesome. Ta da! Moon School is about the adventures of a nerd who goes to school in space, but there's still bullies in space, and so he has to defeat them by suffocating them in the darkness of space. Moon School. New regular. Congratulations, Johnny. Congratulations, Johnny. Don't you know what you're doing? Congratulations, Johnny. Here's what we thought of your crappy game. Congratulations, Johnny. I liked it, but it wasn't that great. Congratulations, Johnny. I played it for days, then I turned it off and broke it. Could have been better. Yeah, damn right, seven. Slut. Give us a get us a game report right now, Dennis. Come on, what do you got for us, Dennis? <laughs> Decrypt. This is a very special offer. Agents have recently managed to borrow some research information which might be of interest to you. If you're interested in then transfer 63,000 to the enclosed uplink location, we'll contact you, Agent Blowfoot. No thanks, dish dickbag. Our post-release analysis of Moon School is complete, and we got the following results. Space and action is great. Engine seems to be very important. From time to time, your employees need to recharge their batteries and go on vacation. You can tell that an employee is in need of rest when their efficiently, efficiency steadily decreases. To give them a holiday, just click on them and select Send on Vacation. Oh, there you go. Dennis, you're literally not doing anything. Listen, Dennis. You're fine. You're fine, Dennis. 
Is it too late? Can I not do 2D graphics? What does medium games even mean? I'm so confused. There we go. Even though I hate fantasy. I should be, you know what I should be doing? I should just be testing out all these platforms. Hey, Dennis, we made like, what, one game and you're being a dickbag? Let's uh, do fantasy, RPG, um, do it on the PC, and go for it. And it's going to be called Turtle, no, mm. no, wait, no, wait, I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. 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 Knights of Tertonia. Yeah. Knights of Tertonia. The turtle based RPG game from Tummy Sausage. Ah, yes. You never thought that things could get any better. Oh, but they have. Knights of Tertonia was a turning point for Tummy Sausage. Uh, it, it, it was we we had gone through uh, a few bad games. Moon School we we just released and it, it did okay, but it wasn't great. And uh, our, our main our main lead designer Dennis he was feeling a little bit down, but uh, I, I think it really turned around when we got up to the uh, the the design stages. Uh, it really it, it picked up a lot, and uh, that's that's where things it, it, we started to craft the story from there. And the main protagonist, um, Turton, Turton, he's the main turtle you play as. We really fleshed him out a lot, and this is when we realized where we wanted to take the game, how we wanted to craft it, and after that, uh, it basically made itself. And uh, uh, you know, it was hard. It was hard. I know. I know. Dennis, he really needed a big vacation. Right after that, um, he went immediately on vacation. It, it, it was. It was amazing. We sent him on vacation. He left. He disappeared, actually. He teleported out of the office. We clicked finish game, and uh, he went away. And uh, the, he got the reports in while he was on vacation. And I think that just made the uh, the vacation even that much more better for him, really, to be completely honest. First reviews of our newly released game, Knights of Tritonia, came in. It was, it was one of her top box hits next to Cigar Office Lover Man. I always forget the name of Cigar Office Lovable Man. I, I, I always forget. It's, it, it, you know, it's a... But, but it's, it's still a good game. Yeah, no, it was a good game. I, I enjoyed it. Everyone everyone really enjoyed it. And that was our breakthrough game, really. For me, at least. I'm, I, I, you know, I just, I'm just... I'm just... Generate game report, you slut! Stop scratching your head, you slut! I need to know of Knights of Teutonia. Today, Nintendo announced the much-anticipated successor to the popular test console. This is the greatest console, console we have ever built. It comes with start of the state-of-the-art bit graphics, and it does things like uh, plays fetch with you. Fans around the world have been waiting for this moment, and seems they will not be disappointed. Yay! Yay! Kermit the Frog! Yay! Our post-release analysis of Knights of Tetonia is complete, and we got the following results. Fantasy RPG is great. Story quests seem to be very important. Platform genre match RPG PC is good. Some additional insights. We should try to focus our entire team on the development of a game. Um, don't we always do that? Is Dennis, like, jerking off in the corner when we do that? I don't understand. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Okay, so um, I'm actually going to steal up here. I'm going to swap here. Um, I actually do enjoy this game a lot. Um, hope you guys have enjoyed this. Um... If I have free time, I'll continue this because I would like to finish at least one playthrough of this. And I, I would imagine it's a fairly, I mean, you could probably go on for a while, but I'm just going to stop now just because I don't have the time. So, uh, yeah, hope you guys have enjoyed this for Indie Sunday, and I shall see you in this future. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.